Calaroga Shark Media. It's another episode of Five Good News Christmas Stories this month on Tuesday and Thursday. Astor Ireland brings you some Yuletide happiness. Amanda McCormick had an unexpected twist to her holiday decorations when a curious koala became a living ornament on her Christmas tree. The adventurous marsupial made itself at home among the branches of her white pine tree, creating a truly Australian Christmas scene. Amanda captured the moment with photographs before reaching out to the wildlife rescue team, 1300 koalas, who initially suspected the call to be a prank due to the unusual nature of the situation. The rescue organization shared the incident on Facebook, humorously noting that the koala seemed eager to partake in the festive celebrations. Amanda resides in Coromandel Valley, located in the southern part of Australia, an area where koalas venturing into homes is a rare but not unheard of event, according to D. Hearn Halon, co-founder of 1300 Koalas. Once rescued, the young female koala was safely released back into the wild in a locale well-suited for its species, promptly finding a new tree to ascend, leaving behind a charming story and a reminder of the proximity of human and wildlife habitats in Australia. Back in 2019, Liam Beach, a Welsh animal management graduate, pulled off an impressive feat for the festive season. He successfully dressed all 17 of his dachshunds in holiday jumpers and arranged them on his staircase for a remarkable group Christmas photo. Beach revealed that this photo shoot with his dogs, Buster, Daisy, Ziggy, Wally, Zach, Bonnie, Safi, Duke, Diamond, Ruby, Kizzy, Sammy, Kanzi, Kiki, Lottie, Benji, and Dudley, was quite the endeavor, requiring a full bag of treats and a hefty dose of patience, totaling nearly an hour. This was a contrast to a previous photo session that took him only about 10 minutes. The 20-year-old from Rhonda, Wales, had to deal with the dog's excitement over their holiday attire as they mistook the dress-up for a signal that it was time for a walk, leading to a chaotic run around the house. After settling the pack down, Beach managed to snap a picture that was charming enough to be the highlight of any social media page during the holidays. An inspiring incident from a man's youth was recounted, where his father displayed exceptional compassion during a holiday season. They discovered one of their bicycles had been stolen and managed to locate the young boy responsible. Behind his grandfather, the boy, merely 10, was found distraught, confessing his desire to have something for Christmas. With the recovered bicycle, the man's father collected some coal and inquired if there was a spare bicycle available. In silence, he took the items and returned to the young boy's residence. There, he presented the bicycle and coal to the boy, also giving him an additional $20, simply stating, Merry Christmas. Advent calendars are a festive staple for many, marking the countdown to Christmas. But the Zoological Society of London has decided that the joy of daily surprises shouldn't be exclusive to humans. They crafted a unique version of the Advent calendar for their animal inhabitants using red and green buckets marked with the dates of December. Each bucket was a trove of beloved snacks tailored to the preferences of different species. Penguins received servings of fish, and meerkats were delighted with crickets. And let's wrap up today's episode with a look at the magic and whimsy of the holiday season through the eyes of children. Imagine the joy on children's faces when their peculiar Christmas wishes are fulfilled by none other than Santa himself. Let's dive into some of the most delightfully odd requests that were granted. Take, for instance, a four-year-old's unique wish for a puzzle depicting his dad on the throne, the toilet, that is, with the lid down and a magazine in hand. This 70-piece challenge was conquered in mere minutes and declared the best gift ever. Then there's the three-year-old who dreamt of a Paw Patrol piñata bursting not with candy, but fruit snacks and for Hanukkah, no less. Or the nearly eight-year-old who yearned for soda, a treat usually off-limits, and found six mysterious unlabeled bottles under the tree. We've got a four-year-old who aspired to have his own extended reach grabber, just like his grandmother's, and a boy whose unusual request for a dead squirrel was ingeniously met with a flat dog toy squirrel, dead as specified. 
Let's not forget the girl with a penchant for saltine crackers, receiving them joyfully as a recurring gift, or the five-year-old who asked Santa for a tornado, which turned out to be a handheld water vortex toy. Other quirky gifts included a solid wood Lazy Susan for a car-loving two-year-old, a manual orange and lemon juicer for a seven-year-old budding mixologist, and strawberry marshmallow fluff for the princess who wished for pink toast. And who can overlook the simple yet specific request for a little red box with yogurt inside? Or the boy who got a whole case of mac and cheese from Costco? Then there's the child who wished for an eyeball ornament and found a sparkly one for just $4. And the one who asked for a Spider-Man transformer, unaware of its peculiar design. Other gifts range from a toaster, a box full of empty paper towel rolls, an apple peeler with a suction base, a clipboard, a dictionary, to even a traditional Christmas Dr. Pepper for a family that doesn't usually indulge in soda. But perhaps the most heartwarming story is of an eight-year-old who, instead of asking for a toy or game, requested that Santa feed all the animals at the shelter. With the help of the community, this young philanthropist's wish was granted, bringing a bounty of food and treats for the grateful shelter animals. These stories aren't just about the gifts, but about the spirit of giving, the understanding of loved ones, and the pure, unpredictable imagination of children. It's a beautiful reminder that sometimes, the strangest wishes can bring the greatest joy. Thanks to Johnny Mac for letting me share these stories with you. Have a great day.